Yeah. Raheem Abraham. I never was. <laughs> Daniel Strigo. And he is a hammer. Yeah. Strigo's actually the one who's the uh, cadet national All-American. All-American, so. I know, like, uh, who wins in the weight room. Oh, nice little duck there. One blue. One blue for stepping out. Yep. Yeah. It's okay. It's good wrestling. Yeah. It's okay because he's attacking. Yeah, for sure. And you guys will see this, but, I mean, no one meet is worth, you know, like, there's always exceptions to the rule, right? I mean, if you're being aggressive and doing things, even if it costs you one out of a hundred... You just pat the guy in the butt and go, yeah, hey, man, we'll yeah. get him next time, yep, you know? agreed. Well, I'll, I'll go back to 2017 World Championships in Paris, mm-hmm. which I was fortunate enough to be on that trip. Jordan Burroughs won his fifth world title and gave up the first takedown in every bout. Yep. And maybe that's how you get loose. <laughs> There's, I mean, if, if, you're, if your plan is just wrestle to every situation, you're going you're gonna to start winning every situation. Right. Well, the analogy I always make with my guys is, you know, if you give me my favorite golf course, my favorite hole, my favorite club, the pin exactly where I want it, on a lucky day I might be able to beat, you know, you know, Brooks Kepka, Tiger Woods, Mm -hmm. whoever. We play four hours, eighteen holes, it's a wrap, no way, right? So you're the better guy or the better girl. You want to be in as many as many wrestling positions and as many scoring opportunities as possible because if there's seven scrambles you'll win four of them correct there's one scramble anybody can win anybody can win and you know like you know we we, whenever guys really good guys generally don't lose 10 to 9 matches they lose these 3 to 2 matches and I'm I'm more in folk style scoring now but I mean it's the same thing right if I was red that's when you throw it what did you think the call was well because I think red tried to throw he stepped out and planted red on his back so you think you should have won one, been but one red? depending on where the camera is, is also a question I would have asked. Right. Well, we got three angles. Oh, I think they would have won that one. Yeah, I, I made a call on one of those earlier today, and they went, the team went around me, and nothing you can do. I can do, yeah. I saw the four red, four red, four red confirmed. Yep. But it's hard to give a guy points when he's laying on his back sometimes. I, I agree, I agree. It, you're right, it's, it's a rough one. I've even used that argument to go, he was on his back. How did you not give me points? <laughs> <laughs> that's the goal of wrestling, right? right yeah. We had a, a possible leg foul in a match earlier, and I was judging, and I was the only one that could see it. Guy arm spins and releases gotcha. yep. to try to yep. take the guy through. So it's offense, and so we're, mm-hmm. we're not hurting in a lot of stuff here. Right, right, yep. And the coach from the team went to the... Iowa, mm-hmm. he went to the temple and said, what did you see? And it was an excellent question because he knew I could see it. Yeah. But he knew I was the only one who could see it. Right, yeah. But that's a good way to, like, not use your brick, like what Coach was saying right. a couple matches yeah. ago. Mm-hmm. And the young, the young chairman said, I went with the official that had the only one. Perfect. It's a better it's a answer. answer. Great answer. Yeah. Love it. You know, I would just make sure he was talking about you. <laughs> There you go, Which right? Which official were you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> that would have been my only follow-up. Because if we would have thrown or said to the other one, I'd be like, uh-oh. <laughs> no. Now we have to talk about this. <laughs> well, it looks here like Illinois is about to pull the sweep off. And yeah. California wins third with a 45-25 decision over Oklahoma. Oklahoma. Yep. So Illinois just won the girls yep. against Washington. And... Uh, that was a crazy duel. Wrap yeah. Washington up. ran out 18 to 1, and then Illinois scored went 39 to 1 the rest of the way. Wow. And there were two matches where Washington was winning by six points. Illinois stamped them down and headlocked them. Wow. So I mean if, if you figure that's you know 5-0 versus 3-1 the other way. Yeah. Those are 14 point swings total. That's a big swing. Well, we, we looked at it going into the last match, it would have been one point. <laughs> you know, <laughs> and you know, oh, maybe you don't wrestle quite. <laughs> yeah, You're channeling Mark Manning, I love yeah, it. Yeah, right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What do you think of that duck under as a high or high dive as a way to kind of like get out of stuff and reset? You know, it's it's a great idea, but you got to be careful. You catch a guy, you step start stepping in, going forward with your head down. There's a lot of bad things that can happen. A from a referee's point of view. 
B from the other, if you can get it from the wrestling point of view. Meaning, I don't know. I know we're not allowed to coach referees. I know we're not supposed to be saying things. But gosh darn it. Lefty headlock. I got a guy with his head down. I want him to know. <laughs> Good job. Well done. And the ball. That's a perfect song.